Hey guys, what is going on? It's me, King Accessible here, and today, guys, I've got an awesome new series I'm going to be starting with you guys, where we are going to be breaking down each of the individual specialists within Black Ops 3 multiplayer. So I'm going to be doing a video dedicated to each of the six different specialists within Black Ops 3 multiplayer. I'm going to be giving you guys the rundown of all the details we currently know about each specialist, how they play, what exactly different abilities they have, and just really just what they're all about. So basically, if you don't already know, specialist is the new system that Treyarch in putting into Black Ops 3 multiplayer so when you select any multiplayer game you will have to start off in a game by selecting which specialist you want to play as and that there are a total of six different specialists this includes the Ruin, the Ser Seraph, the Outrider, the Reaper, the Prophet and also the Nomad you select which um, specialist you would like to play as at the beginning of the game and each one has their own special power weapon and also special unique ability and all of these will differ from each other depending on which character you have chosen to play it as, but I'm going to be doing a series where I'm going to be breaking down each of the different characters for you guys so you can get a better understanding of exactly which characters might be better situated for your situations and just which ones you might prefer to play as. So, we're going to start it off by talking about the Ruin Specialist. So, the Ruin is basically his real name is Donnie Rolch. The bio we have for him is raised in the military family in a tough neighborhood. He is fearless and headstrong, an infantry soldier through and through. He uses his unique unique abilities to rush into battle and surprise the enemy with sheer force. Now you guys can see some images on screen here of what this guy looks like. This is the guy we've seen in the trailer that has the power spikes which is a really really cool new weapon we've seen. Um, they showed it in the multiplayer reveal trailer when you see right at the end when the guy just slams down the power spikes into the ground. Really really cool indeed. So his power weapon is the gravity spice. The description for these are creates a devastating area of effect shock wave in the surrounding area. Now from what we've seen, it looks like when you slam these into the ground, they create a big shock wave which seems to damage, if not kill, all the areas within the surrounding area. So it's obviously quite a powerful weapon. All the power weapons with the specialists seem to be very, very powerful indeed. I'm not sure exactly how overpowered they will be. Obviously, you do only manage to get them two or three times per game. But at the same time, when you think about it, if everyone's going to be getting them two or three times per game, it might end up becoming slightly annoying when you're just constantly getting killed by these powers. From, from what I've read, read, sorry, it looks as though it is very difficult to not get killed by them because they are so overpowered indeed. But we'll have to see more about that when I actually get to play the game for myself. The special ability on the Ruin is the Overdrive ability. Now, this gives the players a burst of speed for a short period of time. So this is a really cool one. If you're one of the people that likes to just run around as fast as you can, try and get behind the enemy, and just make sure you're not out in the open for too long, and this is really, really gonna be the kind of person you want to be running as, because you've got the gravity spikes, so when you come out of nowhere, you can just smash them down into the ground and just kill as many people as possible, and then you can use the overdrive ability to just get out of there as quick as you can, because I assume all it does is just really increases your speed and just allows you to move out of there much faster. And that's it for this video, guys. I really hope you have enjoyed these videos are only going to be very short because I'm just giving you a quick rundown of each of the characters. But I hope you did enjoy. If you did, please sure to leave a like on this video, and I'll see you guys on my next video.